So the World Cup final just finished and it was not only the best World Cup final in history, it was also the spookiest and here's why. 18 hours before the actual final, I posted a marble race prediction video and brace yourselves because the accuracy of the prediction will blow your mind. As soon as the marbles left my hand, Argentina were out of the blocks so much better than France, which wasn't planned at all, but was exactly how it ended up happening in the actual match. Argentina powered ahead into a dominant lead and I even mentioned in the commentary that France really need to step it up if they want to stand a chance. Now this is where it starts to get really weird. In the marble run, I comment on how Argentina are in complete control and out of nowhere, just as I say that, France overtake them and they do it really fast. Just like in the actual game where France come back from two goals behind in the space of just two minutes. At this point in the game, France had the momentum and just like in the marble run, they looked like they had the advantage. In extra time, Argentina scored and then France quickly equalised, negating Messi's goal and rendering it obsolete, which is the only thing that the marble seemingly left out of their prediction. After predicting a really dominant start by Argentina and an epic comeback by France, in the final stretch, the France marble hits two obstacles obstacles and in the actual game they missed two penalties. France battled so valiantly but just failed to get across the finish line just like in the marble race. And there's more. In the marble race, there's a special mention to Lionel Messi for leading Argentina to their first World Cup victory since 1986. And in the actual game, he scored two goals and ended up winning player of the tournament. Was this all just coincidence or was there something more spooky at play here? Comment below what you think. 